He said completed x over x plus 3 times to what here and what here. So look at the way you clearly. Because he said without replacement. And my question, he said here black, two black. So black, how many black first? So this is the x black. And total are this. So first answer this up and this down. You can see the match. x plus 3 or 3 plus x, so not a problem. You write in different order, like x before and 3. So no issue. Okay. So let's talk about. When you, when you take one black out, what happens? So from here, one reduce, you call an X minus one. And from here, one reduce, it means X plus three already, and one less. And pick up what here? Two. So I can write here, this is a two. So this is the first part is, is over. First part is over. So let's talk about the next part. So first part is over. For, for two marks is over. Okay. Part number two. He said that two black counters is seven by fifteen. So actually, first black. This is called black counter number one. This is called black counter number two. Okay. And he said the answer of this is equal to seven by fifteen. So can I say x by x plus three times two x minus or x plus two equal to seven over fifteen? Why not? And what is the rule? Some do still do wrong wrong practice here. They think it will go up, multiply, it will go there wrong. Whenever you have an equal sign in the middle, it happens like that. But when either we have multiply sign, so top with the top multiplying and the bottom with the bottom. So numerator and then okay. So let's multiply. So x into x, I get x squared. X into 1, I got x x into x, I got x squared. x into 2, I got 2x. 3 into x, I got 3x. 3 twos are 6. And 7 by 15. Numerator, I'm keeping as it is, simply by more. x squared, 3 plus 2 become 5x. And plus 6, 7 by 15. 15 multiplies there. It looked like this. And the whole thing multiplied there, it looked like this. Now I'm simplifying. So 15 into this, I get 15 x squared. 15 into this, I get 15 x. And 7 into this, I get 7 x squared. And 7 5 sir, I get 35. And 7 6 sir, I get 42. Okay. Now after having this, we have to prove a link. So first of all, 15 x, this comes here. I mean the 15x square minus 7x square. Then minus 15x and this also comes here. Minus 35x and minus 42 equal to 0. And let's see what happens then. So I, I from here I get 8x square. From here I get uh, 50x and minus 42 equal to 0. But my demand is 4x square. I need here 4, 4. So naturally divided by two whole equation. Good, by two I got four x squared, by two I got 25 x, and by two we got 21. And then we can get our answer to prove. So this part proved, we have done it, okay. So after that he said write down the number of the black counters in the back. So it means I'm looking for the x values. So let apply, did he have a price? No. He said he did not mention us what to do here, okay? So we have to show it, and now we can do by working here, we, and B part is missing actually here. So we can apply factorization or quadratic formula, okay? So I think, uh, uh, let's go for formula. A is, this is a B part. This A part is over, this is a B part, okay? So A is four, B is minus 25, and C is minus 21. And x is equal to minus b plus and minus b 
b squared 4 times 2a times 2c by 2a. Okay, so my minus and minus become plus. Okay, here I will check what answers come. Here I check what answer comes. So 25 squared minus 4 into 4 into minus 21. It gives me 31 sharp value, 31 over 8. We can do it, correct, you're right. We can do it by normal factorization as well. Okay, so let us look here now. Now, the, there's a plus, one time plus, and one time I will do with minus sign. Okay, so here I get uh, a 6, okay, so minus 6 by 8, and ignore it, because negative comes. So 25 plus 31, we got a 56 by 8, we got a 7, so here 7 answer comes. So it means 7 here, and he's asking what us here from us. Write down the number of the black counters. So black counters total as x. So we can say that black counters are 7. So black counters 7. This is our answer. Let's go for the next part. He is asking now B part. B part for my question. He said that uh, okay, E has a bag of 5 green counters and 4 red. I repeat again. How many green? Five green and four red. So, so total are nine. So five green and four red, total nine. He said that she takes three counters random from bag without replacement. Three counters. So one probability that three counters are all the same colors. So same color, you know very well, we can make a diagram or without diagram, no problem. So I make it without diagram. So, so, so green. So what is the, uh, for all three greens, so let's say three greens. So green, one, five by nine. One reduce, one reduce, four by eight. One reduce, one reduce, three by seven. So this will give me uh, three greens. So let's for three reds. So four by nine is the first red. Second red, one reduce and one reduce. And then two by seven, this is a way. And he said that for this probability, that three counters are all same colors. And after having both answers, I will add. So this answer, please give me answer. What answer comes? Four ones are four, twos are three ones are three, threes are nine. So I got a five and six, seven are 42. So two here are uh, same, three ones are three, threes are two and four, eight cancel, one by 21. So if I add them, so answer becomes, so five by 42 and one by 21. How to make them same? Into 2, into 2. So I got an LCM 42 and 5 plus 2. So 7 by 42 give you 1 by 6. I think so you got a clear.